good evening. Good morning. Good afternoon. Pin my dad. Borrow dad. <laughs> Whatever. It's good to be here. Hope everybody's well. On this, whatever day this is going out. No idea. Could be going out any day. Gonna try something different tonight. Something we've not had before because it's brand new from Tesco, my favourite shop. Tesco will be getting sponsored in a bit. No, we won't. <laughs> we have got Tesco's fine. It's a beef lasagna. Oh, yes, we're going to Italiano again. Hello to all my Italiano friends. How you doing? Don't worry, I'm not going to sing Shut Up Your Face again. Although you never know. What's the matter, you ain't got no respect. <laughs> I love that song by Joe Dolce. Anybody else like it? We've still got somebody. If you're wondering what they're at the back and you've not seen the video, we've got some of the chocolate cake still left there. If you've not seen that video, go and have a look at it because it was so funny. It was hilarious. Even though I made it myself. And I made a rat pig's ear of it. <laughs> yeah, so if you've not seen it, go and have a look. Go and have a giggle. It was so funny. But we will get on with the test goals. We've got three left, by the way. We did have five. We had two last night. So we are starting with the test goals. I better put that sofa fall back on it as well. I don't want them going off. I might as well eat the rest now. I'm not. I've not cocked out yet since I started eating them. Right, we've got Tesco's finest. I just said, told you what it was, didn't I? So it does say, and I need a magnifying glass to read. I need some new glasses. Uh, rich beef, rich beef ragu, ragu, and silky, silky what? Bechamel sauce layered between pasta sheets. Topped with red and cheddar cheese and mozzarella pearls. Okay, perhaps I should read it before I come on. Or doing it off the cuff because I can't read. Let's get it open. As I say, brand new from Tesco, this. Let's have a look. That's what you get inside. Oh, them white things, they look like cash cubes. What are they? I've got a clue. I've got a foggiest. But now they cook this thing. Magnifying glass out again. I need to go spec savers. Other optician side available. Right, we've got oven frozen. 50 minutes. 50 minutes? I'm starving. Gas mark 6. 200 degrees Celsius. And if you've got a fan oven, it's 180. Or you can actually microwave as well. Frozen for uh, 6 minutes. That's on a 800 watt microwave and six minutes on a 900 watt. Allow to stand for one minute, uh, remove film and cook on full power for, for, for four minutes and then three minutes. Well, four minutes on one, three minutes on the other. There we go. That's what it says on the box. Let's get rid of that. Do you need to give it a prick first? I don't know. We'll have a look. Don't need to give it a prick first. We need to give it, take the film lid off. So let's get rid of the film lid. Ah, there you go. Just like that. Nothing can go wrong in this video like the last video. Oh, I don't think it can. Unless it sets on fire. <laughs> There's... <laughs> I love being in the kitchen doing these videos. They know something always goes wrong and nothing can go wrong in this, possibly. Or can it? Right. <laughs> That's what it looks like inside again. So, what did it say? Gas mark 6 for 50 minutes. Right, I need a, I need a uh, tray thing to put it on. I can't just stick... Well, you can just stick it in the oven, but I need a tray first to stick it on a tray and to stick it in the oven. Ah, we have one tray. I don't know why the picture's looking a bit misty. I hope it's not misty to your side. Right, there you go. My picture looks a bit misty today, but there's a mist forming in the kitchen. It's because... Uh, this gorgeous creatures on doing the video and the camera steaming up. Yeah, right, I wish. Right, let's... Uh, so we put that in there. We'll stick it in the oven. Mind the bowl lid. Well, I need to say cutting, actually. No, it does. So I'm getting, it's getting on my pig and nerves now. I, I keep saying I'm going to cut it and I've not around to it. It looks dated at the back. 
I'm just going to get the racer out one day and just go for it. Gas mark 6, I suppose. Not what it's then, so let's go gas mark 6. My oven is now on. Make sure it's on, make sure it's not going to burn. And there's gas mark 6. Thank you very much. Right, so that's that done. Now we have to wait 50 minutes. They might have heard a strange voice on, the, on one of our videos the other day. Tuesday, no Wednesday. Because uh, it was somewhere Scottish. It was our Lorraine, I'm sure a lot of you know. But our Lorraine was in Scotland and she actually did a video for us. And yeah, it was her first attempt at a video. And I think she did absolutely fantastic. It was only a short one. If you've not, if not seen it, go and have a look. Because Lorraine will be doing more videos for us as we go along, all the way from Scotland until we're back again to get until we're back together again. Until we're back again together, even. <laughs> no, until we're back together again. So yeah, Lorraine will be doing more videos for you. From Scotland, from Larkall. Sunny Larkall, where it always suns and there's no snow. Because we have snow in England and they didn't get any in Scotland. And there's me thinking England Scotland always had snow, but no, apparently, we just get in England. I think they had a bit in Wales as well, so I was talking to somebody, I was talking to Jane on, hello Jane, how are you doing? I was talking to Jane on, on Facebook, on the messenger, and she said she did have a bit of snow, but it suddenly disappeared. Anyway, well done Lorraine on the video, and uh, do more for us, yeah. I can have a day off. People want to listen to you and uh, get rid of me, maybe. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> the men can take over the channel. So that's your 55 minutes over. Let's take it out of the oven and have a look what it looks like. There we go. That looks absolutely delicious. I'll do like a bit of a sangue now and then. Just check it's all cooked underneath. Yes, that is steaming. A steaming. Let's get it on a plate. Let's find a plate and get it on a plate. And get it down. Oh, there we go. Loads of pasta. Loads of... Whatever the rest of the stuff is. <laughs> Next thing to do, it's a little taste test. It looks a bit hot to eat, but we're going to do a taste test anyway. Look at the steam coming off that. Look at that. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, that's a turkey. Let's have a taste. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Straight away, I have to say, mmm. That is delicious. Full of mince. Full of pasta, I do have to say. That is one of the best things I've tasted for a long term. One of the best uh, ready meals I've tasted for a long term. I'm going absolutely, that, yeah, if you like lasagna, you will absolutely adore that. It is. That's definitely 10 out of 10. Thank you, Tesco, for that. That's uh Ted Gould's finest beef and sangue. Brand new. So thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. We'll be cooking something else again soon or having a ready meal or whatever or burn some bacon and make a, <laughs> make a mess of making cakes. We've not made a mistake today. We've got through it without making a mistake. Yes, we have. I'll tell a little lie because I did just, uh, I just took the tray out of the oven. So then me just grabbed hold of the tray with my bare hand and nearly burnt my hand. So you didn't see that bit, but it did happen. Yeah. It's alright, it's not that burnt. I just quickly let go. Anyway, thanks for watching. Until next time, keep walk keep walking on sunshine. Keep smiling. Most importantly, look after yourselves. Until next time, remember fun times are always good times. And a ciao for now. See you soon.